What motivates me is, I think one is passion, you know, for life and specifically for football. Obviously I've made that my, my profession, but I think when it comes to life, what motivates me is knowing that there's something bigger, knowing that there's something more than just myself. Um, and for me, that's my faith. And, you know, being the best human being that I can. Um, I just think my, my family's a massive motivation for me. I have my deep-rooted faith because of the way that I was raised. I think my faith plays the role in my life of my foundation. That foundation of faith then drives what I'm doing every day, how I treat my friends, the attitude that I go into, in my case, training with. Because when you strip it all away, I have my faith there, and that's the constant for me. When people click on my profile, the first thing that they should see is that I'm a Jesus follower. But I want people to see the way that I, the way that I speak, the way that I portray myself, the way that I talk about my teammates, my coaches, my family and friends, how I treat people, the things that I promote. I think the foundation of you know, faith, religion, and, and football is, is passion. Anyone that has a belief in any of those things has a deep-rooted passion for it. Whatever anyone's foundation is, whatever their motivation is, if they can let that drive their actions in a positive way, then I think the influence um, is monumental, whether you're using football to influence, which sport is a massive influencer in our world and, and on the internet. And then for me, my faith is that driver. I've made so many mistakes, and to be able to have the perspective of learning from those mistakes, saying, you know, you know I've been given grace, I'm not perfect, but I'm loved, and, but what I've felt has been my role in sport is just to be a good person, to be a good teammate, and to show my teammates the grace that I feel like I'm given. And I know my teammates have gotten a good look of, of my faith and why I do the things that I do and why I act the way that I do and um, are very respectful of that. I love when, when people ask me questions about it because it gives me the opportunity to share without potentially stepping over the line. Um, and I think there's a lot that I'm still learning about bringing faith into a locker room. Have I crossed the line? Where is that line really? Again, it's different with individuals too. Some people are curious, some people really don't care, some people really don't want to hear it. So it's having that understanding and, and realizing that I don't really have to say anything to share my faith. It's all about how I act and, and how I treat them as teammates and individuals. I'm a passionate player. I get angry, I get upset. If I can do my best to act in a way that portrays my faith in the locker room, then I think I'm doing my job. I think I've also been given this incredible gift to play football, which so many people in the world are so passionate about. And bringing that passion and showing that and using my gifts to the best of my ability on the pitch, running hard, tackling hard, scoring goals, having passion about it, being excited for my teammates, like all those things are me shining this light that I've been blessed with. To do that, to be able to do that in sport is really, really special. Do you think they play football in heaven? Uh, absolutely, yes. There's, there's football in heaven, there's dogs in heaven, there's definitely no cats in heaven. Sorry, cats lovers, I did, I'm not a cat person. Whoa. Are you a cat person, Tom? Sorry.